What's going on guys? All right, here's a little FAQ video about the uh, custom toe mirrors and uh, you know a couple of frequently asked questions I've got about them. Uh, so we're just going to go ahead and start right off the bat here. Number one biggest question is are they plug and play? Uh, the answer to this is no, absolutely not. Um, when you're doing these, I mean the mirrors bolt right up to your model year. All that's compatible so uh, you don't have to worry about trimming any plastic or anything. This bolts right up. Uh, so this is like for an 06, so it'll bolt right up to the 06 once you take your stock mirror off. The uh, harness for the power, all that plugs right in, so this plugs in, and occasionally um, you might get one light function with this. I know on some new models, uh, the turn signals are actually built into the harness, um, so the turn signals will be plug and play, and possibly the exterior car the clearance light might be plug and play to some of those models, uh, but most of the time uh, they are not. And uh, that being said, most of the mirrors come with a little extra wiring harness that will plug right in and uh, everything will work off that wiring harness. These mirrors in particular for a 14 to 16 uh, GMC Silverado or a Sierra and obviously pointing out Sierra is spelled wrong so that's awesome. Uh, but here's a wiring diagram uh, so this tells you all the wires on the harness as well as for the lights. Fortunately on this one, this one looks like everything's plug and play. So the blue, white, and um, you know, black wires, all that stuff, it all plugs right in. So all your lights are supposed to work uh, how they're supposed to. I mean, as long as you have uh, mirrors currently with turn signals and all that stuff, heat, all that. When I do a switchback build, what I do, guys, is disassemble the whole entire mirror. I'll take the light out, take the lens off. In this case, I have to paint the chrome backing on this one black and then add the light strips over that. And then what I do, usually taking brand new lens and uh, they come in clear smoked amber you know whatever colors you want to get them in and then I will reinstall them back into the uh, into the mirror as they're supposed to be uh, with the effect that you want this is what these mirrors um, have been ordered as they've been ordered instead of having the black plastic caps uh, with chrome a clear lens black backing and switchback LED strips when I talk about the caps I mean the parts that come off the top and the bottom of the mirror. They either come in black plastic, they come in chrome, or uh, paint to match. You can paint them to match you know, the color of your choice, of your, of your truck. Uh, with a switchback build, none of this stuff is plug and play. So these wires are for the switchbacks. They're for the top and the bottom lights. Each wire has a function. Black is ground, and two reds on each wire make the orange and the white function. So um, most of these mirrors there is some pretty intensive wiring that needs to be done. Uh, so if you aren't very familiar with wiring you may want to, have, want to have somebody else help you with it or you know bolt them up and figure it out as you go along. It's not really that hard and no I don't have any wiring videos because every truck's different. Uh, most of the time uh, I see the things you know you can access the wiring under the dash right under the dash that plugs into your uh, PCM I believe. There's a lot of wiring under there, so you just got to check it out and uh, you know, kind of play with it. But uh, no, these are not plug and play. Uh, secondly, the options that I offer. I still need to break down the options list for you guys, uh, but basically, you know, the caps, chrome, black, are color matched. Uh, I'm going to do a couple of builds that are fully color matched. Uh, they're not easy to do, and uh, I really don't have full capability of doing that without um, outsourcing to somebody else to paint them. Uh, switchbacks are amber LEDs, so we've got switchbacks. And then these are just the standard amber LEDs. So these just light up amber, uh, just as a, a stock OEM 2015 truck. We have clear lenses, smoke lenses, and uh, amber colored lenses. So uh, just depending on what you want. I could also do painted lenses. Uh, say if you have a white mirror, I could have lenses that are actually white to match it. So there's all sorts of options out there. Uh, so when you uh, send me a message, the auto response goes and asks you what options you want. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, you know, for whatever you're making, model truck, um, heated mirrors, power mirrors, you know, stuff like that. So that's what I'm kind of asking. That's what I'm talking about as far as those go. And this is kind of what's all involved into uh, you know building mirrors. They turn from this, uh, the stock mirror here, to the mirrors with the switchbacks and the chrome caps. So options are pretty good and I try my hardest to get everybody what they uh, you know what they want in their mirrors and finally 
Uh, the second question that I get, or I guess the third question that I get quite a bit is do you have any hats or, or decals? Uh, I used to have a bunch of decals with my logo on them. I have one hat that I've made for myself. And uh, if I get a pre-order of probably 20 or so hats, um, I could do a run of them. I could do flat bills or curved bills, you know, uh, whatever, you know, whatever you guys want. So if that's an interest to anybody, then uh, you know, let me know. I, I like to know that stuff. I could also offer them for sale, um, you know, or whatever. So uh, let me know about it. And uh, the hats will probably be around 30 bucks a piece. And, uh, you know, we'll kind of go from there. So... That kind of takes care of a couple of questions, the most common questions on tow mirrors that I get, and uh, you know, hopefully that clears up some things for everybody. Um, as always, thank you for the orders, thank you for uh, all the follows on social media, and uh, thanks for continuing to watch my videos, guys. I appreciate all that, so we'll see you later.